A Japanese power company wants to restart a nuclear reactor damaged by the 2011 earthquake and tsunami. Tohoku Electric has applied for a government safety screening of the reactor at its Onagawa plant in northeastern Japan. A fire broke out at the plant when the quake hit. The tsunami damaged some of the plant's emergency generators. The utility is building seawalls 29 meters high to protect the plant from future tsunamis. It also plans to install a filtered vent by March 2016. Plant officials would use the vent in an emergency to release pressure in a reactor containment vessel. The vent would also limit radioactive emissions. We want to prove that our safety measures meet the new standards set by the Nuclear Regulation Authority. Actually, we're doing more than that. We want local people to know that. We want to dispel their anxiety about the safety of the plant. Utilities have submitted safety screening applications for eight other plants since July. Those plants were not damaged by the quake and tsunami. All reactors in Japan are now offline.